All right, let's give this number five a go. So it says complete the table using this rule, then plot the ordered pairs, then graph them. Choose an appropriate scale for the graph and scale the axes. Okay, so 2x minus 3 is my rule. So that means I'm going to go 2 times input minus 3. So negative 4 minus 3, negative 7. 2 times input minus 3, negative 2, negative 5. 2 times input minus 3, 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 2 times input minus 3. All right. So as I go to graph, I know that 0, 0 is right here. So let's see. This My x values go from negative 2 out to 4. One, two, three, four. You know what? I think I, I might make, make every one one just to kind of spread this out a little. One, two, three, four. That fits really well. Negative one, negative two. And now for my, my y values, it has to go from five all the way uh, all the way down to seven. So one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You know, if I go by if I go by like if I stretch this out anymore, I'm not going to have room to get down to the negative 7. So I'm going to have this go by 1s. Negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, negative 4, 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. All right, so now I can graph my points. Negative 2, negative 7. That's back 2, down 7. Negative 1, negative 5, negative 1, negative 5. 0, negative 3. 1, negative 1, 2, 1, 3, 3, 4, 5. All right, there's my graph of it right there.